Hi, this is Scott with Only Factory Direct, and I'm here today to talk to you about the Mackie MR8 Mark II Studio Monitors. Now, um, Mackie has been making really great products for years, and when it comes to studio monitors, they've been making some of the best monitors on the market. They really make a great quality product, and uh, the price is great for what you're getting. You're getting a really high quality, professional, studio grade monitor. And um, they have some really great functions and features, which I'm going to kind of just give you a quick overview of that. These are high resolution powered studio reference monitors. And what I mean by that is a lot of times people say, you know, hey, I want some, I'm doing some mixing at home. I'm, I got a live band or I got a little studio or I've got some sort of a DJ setup at home. And I'm trying to like mix, you know. Now, for just live performance, things like that, you want a PA style speaker. That's, that's what you need for that type of scenario. But for recording, for anything that you're, you're going to be putting onto a CD or you're making MP3s, um, I doubt anybody's making cassettes or 8-tracks anymore, but you never know. Uh, but if you're making records, you're making music in that manner, you're producing music, you need a reference monitor that's going to be really true to the sound of each instrument. And uh, what I mean by that is, if you're layering drums, you're layering keyboards, you have bass guitar, you have guitar, you have vocals, multi-layers of a lot of those instruments too sometimes. You'll have several guitar parts, several vocal parts, and things like that. When you layer all those out in a sound field, you have this spectrum, this 360 degree spectrum of sound that uh, you really want it, every instrument to lay in its proper place in the mix, and you want everything to have a really true sound. So when you hook a mic up, and you plug it into your mixer and you put it in front of your guitar amp, you want to get as close to that real sound that you have coming out of that amp as possible. And with cheap little uh, monitor speakers that you would normally get for your computer, or small inexpensive PA speakers, or home stereo speakers, or anything like that, if you're using that to monitor that type of recording input, it's not going to be a true sound. You're not going to get the real um, nuances and the warmth and the depth of the instrumentation that you're actually miking and trying to record and reproduce on a recording. So you need a really good quality studio reference monitor. And um, you know the MR8 Mark II is, is really at the top of its class. It's really a great sounding uh, monitor. These are um, you know, high output, um, eight inch studio speakers. They've got a class AB amplifier in it, so it's a really good quality amplification. Um, has a lo-fi, um, low pass filter and a high pass filter uh, functionality on it and I'll flip it around the back here and show you a couple of the things. You have XLR, TRS and RCA input uh, connectivity. Um, these are also magnetically shielded so you can have them next to your computer or a monitor without causing any issues. A lot of times uh, cheaper speakers when you put them next to your monitor you get little squiggly lines and all kinds of crazy stuff going on and uh, that's because they're not properly shielded. These are, so that gives you the uh, safety and uh, confidence that you can put them next to your computer or monitor without any issues. So, um, just to kind of give you a quick little overview, I don't like to do a lot of live sound stuff on video because it really doesn't project the reality of what these really sound like. It's really hard to reproduce audio off of a little small camcorder microphone. But I'm going to just uh, give you a kind of a quick little um, sampling of of these because they really sound great. And it does have an input level on the back so you can raise and lower that. without being um, too crispy or too tinny or anything like that. They have a really nice clarity to the highs and to the mids. And the, the bass is punchy and warm. Very warm, uh, low end and mid range sound. Not too muddy or anything like that. That's, that's a big problem that you see a lot of times with monitoring. Um, you know, people want to get a lot of bass going, especially if you do like hip hop or rap music or if you do like really low down tuned heavy metal music. That stuff gets so muddy in a mix unless you've got a reference speaker that can really reproduce those low frequencies with a lot of clarity. And the MR8 really does that. So let me flip around the back real quick and show you what it's uh, got on the back side. And, uh, okay, so taking a quick look at the back side of the MR8 Mark II, you'll see that we've got a, um, a nice big port down at the bottom here. This is for extra bass projection for um, 
you know, a little bit more uh, low end projection and that type of thing. So it's got a really nice little ported uh, rear end here. Um, you've got some ventilation uh, here for the amplifier so you don't get it too hot. Um, as far as inputs go, we've got an RCA unbalanced input. We've got a balanced TRS quarter inch. And then we have a uh, balanced XLR input as well. Then, uh, as I mentioned before, you have a high frequency filter and a low frequency filter here. So you have a couple of different, uh, three different settings for each of those. And then you have an input selector, uh, input volume control rather. And uh, this is going to change the level of input. So you can kind of set how much, how loud you want your input signal to be to the monitors and then raise and lower it with your mixing board. And then you've got your power. Uh, plug and then your on off switch. So really basic, really easy setup. Um, you know, you just plug into whatever your interface is directly out into this with, with whatever connection you need and you're live and wired, ready to go. So check it out. It's the MR8 Mark II monitor speakers from Mackie at onlyfactorydirect.com.